I was jamming. My hair is all over the place. It's okay. I tried. I tried. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Why did my glasses get foggy instantly? Bro! I'll be hiding steamy. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Bringing this up, but I always have to bring it up. When I left the Kojic Church, don't get me wrong. Some people that's, we didn't leave the Kojic Church. Well, God, God, God made some ways so we could leave. Oh, okay, I was trying to make it sound sweet, but it's okay. Go ahead. Don't get me wrong. Code, there's people that have different experiences than me. This is my experience. I'm talking about me. This is my channel. And see, see here with me, our channel. So I'm talking about my upbringing. Yeah. There was such a freedom because I realized growing up that. You can be saved, sanctified, filled with the Holy Ghost, and still not accept God's grace. It's like I, 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 I get, I hear the teachings. I believe He died. I believe it. But now, you know, yeah. there's some things I have to do. No, no, there's nothing you have to do but believe. Yeah. yeah. God said, "Whoever believes in Me shall not perish." Mm -hmm. Now, like we said before, there's consequences to your actions. Every every action is obviously equal reaction. Signs in there, but at the end of the day, guys still look at you like you are clean. What's cool about it is when you accept God's grace, you can tell. Just like there's 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 fruits that you produce in your walk with Christ, there's a rhythm of grace. You walk different. <laughs> really? Why are you doing the, the you, between? you talk different. Oh, <laughs> oh, you love different. I'm off the screen. You got me serious. You you give. You give differently. You love differently. You love differently. You're more patient. Because you, you know God's patient with you. Why can't I be patient with others? It's just, it's like a melody in your life. <laughs> the rhythm. Rhythm of grace. of grace. Let's check out Matthew 11, 28, 30. I'm about to go, I'm about to go uh, back, back uh, uh, midnight oil with this one. <sighs> Are you cool. tired? Worn out? Burned out on religion? Come to me, get away with me, and you recover your life. I show how show you how to take a real rest. Walk with me, and work with me. Watch how I do it. Learn the unforced rhythms of grace. I won't lay anything heavy or ill fitting on you. Keep company with me, and you will learn to live freely and lightly. Oh. Do you like that? It's, like not, it's like something so something, something, something the DJ would say at midnight. The unforced rhythms of grace. The Bible is cool. The Bible is cool. We are learning with God. <laughs> we are learning with God. We are learning with God. Yes. <laughs> I'm like, this is in the Bible. This is in the Bible. This is in the Bible. There's rhythms of grace. Yeah. Yeah. And, and let's not miss the last part. You still got to do things. Yeah. Let's, let's avoid confusion. There's a yeah. difference between complacency and contentment. Complacency, I'm just going to sit here. God's going to take care of me. When he takes yeah. care of me, I ain't got to do nothing. I ain't got to act yeah. nothing. I ain't got to say nothing. I ain't got to do I ain't got to testify to nobody. I got to act no acts of love. I ain't got to do anything. Complacency. That's complacency. Yes, 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 yes. Contentment is when I know mm -hmm. there's a burden, but I know God got me. Mm. It's not going to be too heavy. Yes, God. God will never give you more than you can bear, and that is grace. Thank you, God. Yeah. He, he, Sierra talked in the last video about obedience. Mm -hmm. People hear that word obedience, they get so uptight. You do, they, they get so <laughs> he gets so tight, tight, tight your booty. <laughs> you tight your booty. You start walking a little. But it tight. makes you feel that way because yes. with obedience, that means it's not in your control. It's yes. not in your will. It's in God's will. So that's why we get like, oh no, 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 no. Because no, no, you're afraid what he's gonna tell you. What, what are you gonna tell you? In that walk of obedience, exactly. <laughs> and it's out of your control because you are being obedient to his will for your life. So yeah, yeah. it makes you very uncomfortable. That's a natural emotion, y'all. Don't don't think that we're saying that these things are just so easy to walk into. It's a little change, it's a challenge. 
especially when you have been in control of your own life, your own success, your own, your own utopia. Now it's like, oh, okay, this utopia is controlled by you. Oh, okay. Well, how am I supposed to get it up? How am I supposed to get up control when I have found my life in it? I have invested so much of who I think my identity is. And it's not, it's not, you have made that way. That's how you've been able to live and progress by your own control. But now once you expect, accept his love and his grace, it's out of your control. And that is scary for us. It's scary for a lot of people because it's not by your, your will. It's by God's will. Amen. He's going to ask you to do some things that you might not want to do. He's going to ask you to go some places that you might not want to go, but it's going to be the, for the betterment of you and the people around you. It's not always about you. It's about others. Man, and I, what I love about God is that he will, like he said in the Bible, it's going to be light. Yeah. It's going to be light. He's going to make you practice that obedience muscle. Mm-hmm. It's like, go say hi to that the guy. Person. Uh-huh. Go mentor that boy. Yeah. Go speak life into somebody that huh. doesn't have any life. Huh. This week, God has really been testing me personally. I got yeah, to talk that's why I pointed. That's why I pointed. Like, eh? You're gonna, eh? You're, and it's hard because I know with obedience also comes responsibility. Mm. It's not God's that's going to give you something just so you can look good, mm. just so you can drive a Maserati, just so you can make another little money bank account. It's so you can do it up to others as He's done to you. And He's calling you for He. He's asking you to do whatever it is. For his glory, yes. not your glory. Yeah. That's what grace is all about. Yeah. And they're going to ask you. People are going to look at you. They're already looking at me funny. Why are you, why are you, why are you acting like this? Why y'all so... Because so, the grace that wait, God... Here go, here go, here go. Why y'all so positive? Y'all, why y'all so positive? Y'all, man, people ain't always happy. Are you really... Are y'all, y'all really, really happy? happy? We had to learn how to get this happy, man. Came at a cost of sacrifice right. and work. This is just happy, my bad man. Yes, we're happy people and we're jolly people, but at the same time, we're human. Watch, watch, watch. We, we were, I was doing this. Sierra was, Sierra was doing this. We doing back at the top. He does a demonstration. Let me do a demonstration. We're, we're I'm done like this until eventually, until eventually, come over here. Okay, okay. Until eventually, okay. we start getting a rhythm. Hey, hey, we start getting a rhythm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We walk differently. Hey, we talk differently. We love we differently. Love differently. Hey. And we give differently. Praise God. I pray that the rhythm of grace starts falling on you. Get in sync with the Lord. God, do what you got to yes, do. God. Start small. Let that burden be light so they can trust in you. Yes, Continue to, to hear your voice yes. and, and, and provide all their needs, all their wants, so yes. that they could start moving. It's your steps. Yes, this rhythm of grace is not about our steps. It's about yes. getting into that rhythm with yes, you. Lord. And God, let them, let them feel your blessing. Your let them feel their presence on yes, you in Jesus' name. Amen. We thank y'all so much. We love y'all. Y'all keep it going. Like, share, comment, all that good stuff. Yes, do that. Comment down below. Let us know how you gracing it in. Ha! Hashtag gracing it. Ah! Hashtag not guilty. We love y'all. We're going to walk out some very white. (laughs) All you smooth cats. Yeah, I guess. Bye, Bye, (laughs) y'all.